So hello and welcome to our Logo Mets webinar today. Uh, the topic is marketing from the ground up, branded mats ideas for diverse industries. I have a couple of quick announcements and then we'll get started. Um, all lines today are muted and cameras are off upon entry and will remain muted for the duration of today's webinar. If you would like to ask a question, please enter it into the Q&A panel and that Q&A session will take place at the end of today's webinar. If you experience any issues with audio or viewing the presentation today, uh, leaving the webinar and re-entering uh, should fix most technical issues. If you continue to have problems, please contact the organizer. Uh, for your awareness, this webinar is being recorded and the presentation and the slides, as well as some additional resources will be provided to you following today's presentation. Next slide, please. So in addition to today's webinar, we have two more coming later this year. We hope you will consider joining. On October 8th, we have the webinar called uh, Winter Readiness, How to Keep Facilities Safe and Efficient with Effective Matting. And on December 10th, we have Ordering Made Easy, Tips for Fast and Efficient Logo Mats Purchases. Um, if you would like to register, you can go to logomatsllc.com slash webinars, and I will also share the link to this page in the chat once we get started. Uh, next slide, please. And I am excited to introduce Diana Nolan as your presenter today. Uh, Diana has been a valued member of the Logo Match team uh, for three years with experience in the customer service and the artwork department. In her current role as the inside sales representative, she knows Logo Mats has the she knows that the Logo Mats has the best products, loves to talk about floor mats, and is passionate about you having just the right product for your customers. So thank you so much for joining us today. And now I will turn it over to Diana. Hello and welcome. I'd like to thank you all for sharing your time with us today and welcome to our webinar, Marketing from the Grand Up, Ground Up Branded Mat Ideas for Diverse Industries. On today's agenda, I'm going to talk a little bit about logo mats, who we are, what we do, what you can expect from us. Uh, we're also going to explore our new industry-specific brochures. We've put our 60-plus years of experience to work for you with brochures designed to address specific needs. We'll talk about the applications of those needs and the solutions, and then we'll talk a little bit about how we support you. So a bit about logo mats. We are in LaGrange, Georgia, which is about an hour southwest of Atlanta. We've been family owned and operated for over 60 years. And we're the promo arm of Mountville Mills M&A Matting, and they're the largest mat manufacturer in the world. Our commitment to you is integrity, quality product, and the quickest turnaround times in the industry. We never have setup fees and we never have artwork fees. Every price we quote you will include setup and also a full color imprint using the palette for that product. Each of our products has a set standard color palette that was developed especially for our printers. We do have a handful of products that we're also able to perform a PMS matching service on if needed. Everything's made right here in the good old US of A, right here in uh, LaGrange, Georgia. We tuft our own carpet and we make our own rubber. Everything's made right here. And this last point, 100% customer satisfaction policy. What that means to you is we're going to make it right every time. If anything should go awry, no matter who is at fault, please know that Logomats is going to make it right for you and your customer every single time. 100% customer satisfaction. We stand behind our products and services. And I am very pleased to introduce to you our new industry brochures. We've developed these with the goal of empowering you to have some productive conversations with your clients. 
Now, of course, we only work with distributors. We have no contact whatsoever with end users, but obviously we see the designs and we see the ship to addresses. So we know who's purchasing these and what they're using them for. So let's delve into that a little further. Solutions to industry specific challenges. Whether your customer is looking for a welcome mat, they're looking for something to promote their brand, their service, they're looking to host a fundraiser, we have a solution. The functionality, the safety of the mat to prevent slip and fall accidents and keep their facilities clean and dry. Comfort, anti-fatigue mats, it's proven fact that they enhance employees' productivity and comfort. Whatever the need is, we have the solution for your customer. And it's the perfect marriage of branding and functionality. So let's explore that a little further. Let's say your customer is looking for a welcome mat. Obviously, a welcome mat is going to make a great first impression. And it's going to speak volumes about how your customer feels about their brand, their service, their product, their image, their business. Some examples of great welcome mat options are our Digiprint, our Super Scrape, our Berber, and our Waterhog. And let's take a look at some of those. The Digiprint HD is our most popular product overall. And this is a plush indoor carpeted mat. And this is kind of our go-to welcome mat. It's our number one best-selling product overall for very good reason. It's a beautiful, beautiful mat. And we can also produce these in custom shapes. So if your customer is looking for a statement piece, something that's really, really going to make an impression, the DigiPrint custom shapes are a fantastic product. Very, very cool. Another option for a welcome mat is the Berber. And the Berber is a heavy-duty looped pile carpet. This can handle extremely heavy traffic. The Berber could also be used outdoors under a covered area, but those are some great solutions, the DigiPrint and the Berber, for a welcome mat. Now, this is also going to check a few other boxes, too. Obviously, having a carpeted welcome mat is going to be uh, a solution to keep your customer's floors clean and dry. So that's going to check that safety box too. Another need, safety. Obviously, keeping the facility clean and dry and to prevent slip and fall accidents. Now, a slip and fall accident isn't going to happen on the mat. It's going to happen when that visitor walks off the mat onto the floor. So we want to keep these mats clean and dry with some, or keep the floors clean and dry rather, with some mats that are going to scrape and grab debris and dry shoes or boots. Some good options are our Super Scrape Impressions. This is an all rubber mat. It's UV resistant. It's also chemical oil, grease, and solvent resistant. It has a cleated surface, so scrape debris off shoes. And as a sidebar, I want to note here, there's an indoor mat and an outdoor mat in this example photo. Whenever you have the opportunity to offer your customer a matting system, having an outdoor mat as a first line of defense, number one, it's going to keep their facility that much cleaner and drier. It's going to help the indoor mat to do its job, and it's also going to extend the life of the indoor mat, plus you've just doubled your sales. Another great option to keep floors clean and dry is the Waterhog Impressions. This is a very unique product. It's a compressed carpet that has fibers running through it. And those fibers allow this mat to absorb up to a gallon and a half of water per square yard. And then it dries out quite quickly. It's also pressed with a mold to achieve this waffle texture. So now it's a scraper mat too. For comfort, these are anti-fatigue mats designed to increase employee productivity and comfort. We have our Hog Heaven. We have a new product called the Branded Comfort. And then we also offer non-logoed Hog Heaven mats. And we have Kneeling Comfort mats. 
So let's take a look at a few of these. First, we have the Hog Heaven. This is an all night trial rubber mat, so it's going to have the properties of being chemical, oil, solvent, grease resistant. And we're marketing this towards your manufacturing facilities, your production facilities, any place where uh, the staff is going to have uh, chemicals, grease, whatnot on their shoes or boots. This is a great solution. And then we also have a brand new product. This is our branded comfort. Now, this is a synthetic leather material. This product has a full bleed imprint area, and we're marketing this uh, for retail, hospitality, really any industry that has staff asked to stand in one spot for a very long time. Next, let's talk about promoting and signage. Uh, these mats are intended to promote a product, a brand, or a service. So think directional signage, your trade shows, your events. The first example is our floor impressions, and this is an all-night trial rubber mat, and this is intended for long-term applications. Let's say, for instance, Wolverine's going to have this out in front of their display for years to come. This is a great solution for that. Another example for uh, promoting and signage is our counter mat. Now, this particular mat, we do ask for a minimum order quantity of 25 pieces. That being said, most sources for countertop type mats uh, ask for MOQs in the hundreds or even thousands, and they're coming from overseas. We can turn these around in about a week, and we ask for an MOQ of only 25 pieces. So it doesn't have to say Ben and Jerry's. It can have your customer's own message on this mat. So any industry that has, you know, customer-facing um, option to present this mat on a countertop. And you can sign a receipt on these, by the way, which is huge. We also carry bar mats, either the long rail mat or the 14 by 14 square countertop mat. These are full bleed imprint area. And with the bar mats, we do ask for a minimum order quantity of 20 pieces. Applications are obvious here. Let's talk about fundraising. We have seen uh, quite an increase uh, in demand for fundraising mats for schools, uh, political fundraisers, school fundraisers. What a unique way to bring it up to the next level. Give you some examples, our pop mat. Now, this is a needle punch polyester mat that's typically marketed for short-term use in a commercial setting. But we've seen just an explosion of popularity with these mats being used for residential end users. And in that setting, we would expect this mat's life to be two to three years. Obviously, not as high traffic in a residential setting as it would be in a commercial setting. Your distributor price points on this product, very, very attractive. And we can do one-offs. So let's say, for example, a school fundraiser. Each family, if they're ordering a mat, they can have their own name on their welcome mat. So we can do one-offs on these. Another example is pop scrape. We've taken the low-cost versatility of the pop mat, and we've given it a scraper surround. So that's going to further extend the life of that mat and give it some added functionality. N Next, we're going to explore the ways that we support you. First of all, we never charge for virtual proofs. You are more than welcome to send us your customers' artwork files. You don't need to have an order in-house, even if you're just prospecting. Please feel welcome to send us the files. We feel it's very impactful for your customer to see their logo on their new mat. We also don't charge for samples. We have a full kit that we can send you. The kit itself is absolutely no charge. We would ask that you provide a shipper account or your credit card to cover the shipping, but that's just for the kit. 
Over and above that, if you ever needed individual samples, we're happy to send those. Again, no charge, and individual samples would be shipped at our expense. We can either send these to your office or ship them blind directly to your customer. And this last point, consultation. We would like to invite you to feel welcome to call us or email us so that we can explore your customers' needs and recommend just the right product. Now, whether your customer has approached you and articulated the need, whether you have visited your customer and you've identified this need, or whether you'd like to offer your customer an add-on to something you're already doing for them, we have the solution and we'll recommend just the right product for you. All right, with that, I think we'll open this up to a little Q&A. Thank you, Diana. Uh, so everyone, if you have questions, please put those in the Q&A panel. And just for everyone's awareness, uh, following today's webinar, you will get um, an email with a survey and then a second email with that recording the PDF of the slides and links to different brochures. So um, if, but right now we are doing the Q&A. So it looks like we have a couple of questions. Um, one person is wondering if we have the digital generic videos um, that we can share of our products. Unfortunately, we do not yet have uh, blind videos. We do have blind product brochures, however. Okay. And that kind of lends into the next question is where I can find the market specific brochures. And like I mm -hmm. mentioned, those will be in that follow up email that we send out. Right, right. And we will be sending you the um, unbranded blind versions. So that way you're able to share those with your customers. Uh, next question here, uh, what is the minimum order quantity for the Hog Heaven mats? Mm -hmm. um, and then what is the turnaround time for production for a low quantity? Mm -hmm. With all of our floor mats, no minimum order quantity. You can order just one mat. The only products that we ask for MOQs on are the countertop mats and the bar impressions. Lead times generally for smaller orders, four to six business days once we have proof approval and payment all squared away. For larger orders, we would advise the estimated production time. Okay, uh, we do have a comment. I'm just gonna to read it and share just some ideas so that mm -hmm. um, fundraising has become a great vertical for schools, nonprofits, political campaigns, et cetera. So, mm -hmm. Um, if you, you know, collect donations and they will receive a mat as a gift. So just an idea um, that was shared in the chat. And then uh, the next question is, what type of artwork files do you accept for virtual proofs? Mm -hmm. Our artwork department would prefer vector files. However, as long as the file is high resolution, at least 300 DPI, we can ensure a good quality proof, which becomes the production file that prints your customer's mat. So as long as we have a good quality artwork file, high resolution, we'll get a real good quality print on your customer's mat. Um, we just have a comment here of someone uh, needing a sample that they didn't receive. So Jenny, we'll make sure to, to take your name and information and we will follow up with you after today's webinar. Certainly will, I'll um, investigate and we'll find out what's going on. Um, let's see here. Um, are the back of the samples marked with names and colors available? They are not. Um, samples should be sent out. There's a sticker on the back, but those, uh, those fall off occasionally. Um, all of the available color palettes are listed on our website. If you were to log on to our website and up in the upper right hand corner, click on products and then all logo mats, all of the products will come up in alphabetical order. You can click on that products page 
and that product's available color palette will be displayed with the PMS equivalents listed. Okay. Um, would you be able to help with creating a mail campaign to promote this product as a fundraising idea or a great product to grow brand awareness? Mm -hmm. um, it, it, that depends on what all is involved. Um, unfortunately, we're not always able to offer uh, um, private graphic design services or marketing, digital marketing services to each of our distributors. Uh, that being said, we may have uh, the tools to offer you uh, that will assist you in, in putting that together. My email address is up on the screen. Uh, whoever asked that question, please feel welcome to send me some more information and some more details, and, and let's investigate that and see what we can do for you there. All right. Uh, next question, how do end users deal with cleaning of the mats? That's a great question. Each of our mats cleaning instructions, they are available on the website. Some of the mats are a bit more easy to maintain than others. For instance, the rubber mats. Those are kind of set it and forget it. Those can easily be broomed off or just picked up and shaked out. The carpeted mats, uh, it's kind of a different animal. Some can be laundered. Some can be cleaned. But each individual product, those cleaning instructions are available on their website. Please feel welcome to shoot me an email asking for that, and I can provide that for you as needed. All right. Um, so someone here has samples from about 2018, and they're mm -hmm. wondering if they should order new samples. I would encourage that, um, uh, especially um, because uh, our Waterhog Impressions color palette uh, has been upgraded. Also, the DigiPrint HD, uh, about two years ago, we upgraded from a nylon carpet material to a PET carpet material. The PET being far superior in both quality and durability as opposed to the nylon, also allows for a better print definition. So that color palette shifted just a bit. So I'd really encourage you to um, go ahead and reach out to us to request a new sample kit. Okay. Um, Mike, we do see your hand raised there. So we this webinar, we cannot bring you off mute. So if you have a question for us, uh, please put that in the Q&A. Um, or if it's something that's a little more involved, feel free to send an email to that sales at logomatsllc.com email address. Um, all right, so the next question here, um, can we do our own virtuals on your website? Absolutely. Once you're logged into your account, you'll see a button that says submit artwork. If you click on that button, you have the option to download your customer's artwork file. You'll select the product and the size, the orientation, whether it's portrait or landscape, and you can select the colors that you want to see. You'll then enter your email for proof return, and our artwork department will return a proof to you as quickly as possible. That's option number one. Option number two is you can email us your customer's artwork files and just let us know what you'd like to see. All right. Um, so let's see. Next one here. Do you have guidelines for typical mat sizes for commercial buildings? Um, for example, a, a double, a standard double entry doors. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. um, we do typically for a single door entrance, uh, the most popular size would be a three by five, and for a double door, would be a four by six. Uh, that being said, some folks have a, a larger vestibule at their front entrance that maybe they want to cover more area with the mat. It would really be a case-by-case -case basis. What does your customer need? And, you know, that, that's something um, that those of you who have ever uh, spoken with me on the phone or emailed me, uh, you may find that I ask a lot of questions. And that's because, uh, you know, we want to make sure that your customer is getting the right product for their needs and the right size. Um, 
this is obviously an investment for your customer and, and their name is on it. It matters. Uh, it's very important to us that your customer is getting the right product and the right size. So that would be addressed with the inquiry. All right. Um, do all the mats have a QR code on the back of the mat? And what info is displayed when someone opens that QR code? Uh, you know, that is a very good question that I do not know the answer to. Miles, for the assist. <laughs> yes, um, most all the products have the QR code on the back. And what that information is for, it's for uh, quality. Uh, if, let's say something goes wrong with the product. Uh, when you scan it, it tells you the day the map was made, the day it was printed, the day it was pressed. Uh, it gives us information should uh, there be something wrong with, maybe, say, a batch of rubber or, say, a print color uh, that happened during that day. So it's it's not information that uh, talks about logo maps or uh, the customer uh, or the end user. It's just for quality uh, assistance with the product. Thank you, Miles. Thank you. Um, let's see. What is the current turnaround time for artwork proof art, artwork proof virtuals after we email the artwork? Mm -hmm. We do ask for 24 hours for proof return. Now, sometimes our artwork department is able to get proofs back quite quickly. Other times um, they're just inundated with proof requests. It really depends on the day, but they should return the proof to you within 24 hours. All right. Oh, that being said, if there is ever a time when you really need a proof to be expedited, please reach out to me. I can make that happen. All right. Let's see here. Um, can you explain more into the anti-fatigue properties? Mm -hmm. Sure. Uh, our anti-fatigue mats are going to be cushioned. And um, studies have shown it's a well-known fact that anti-fatigue mats are going to improve employee productivity and comfort. If you've ever had to stand in one spot all day for a long time, it's quite painful. So our anti-fatigue mats, they're ergonomic. They were designed to um, support that person who has to stand in one spot all day. It's helpful to their legs, to their back. Uh, they're quite cushioned. And as I mentioned earlier, we have two different types of anti-fatigue mat. The Hog Heaven, which is marketed more towards your manufacturing and production industries because of the properties of the nitrile rubber. And then we have that new branded Comfort Mat, which is marketed more towards retail hospitality. All right. Um, how do we register to receive an online Logomat account? You are more than welcome to send me an email at sales at logomatsllc.com. I will reply to your email with an onboarding uh, kit for you to include a link where you can set up your account. Um, some uh, good information about the different contacts here, either myself for anything pre-sale, our orders department to submit an order, our artwork department. And I would also include your distributor price list, our suggested retail, and some other information that you might find useful. So please feel welcome to reach out for me. I'll set you up with everything you need. Okay. Um, how can I find my price for a mat to quote the customer? Well, you can do this one of two ways. You are welcome to send me an email. I am, My role is to provide you with not only product recommendations, uh, but your distributor pricing. You could also log on to your account on our website. And if you hover over the button that says my account, the fifth option down is your distributor price list. Right. But you, you would have to be logged into your distributor account in order to view this confidential information. We do not want any end users stumbling across this. So you would have to be logged into your account. All right. Um, are we able to book you for a webinar to train our sales team? 
Absolutely. I would be delighted to present a private webinar to you and your team. Um, please feel welcome to send me an email and we'll uh, explore some potential dates and times and get that scheduled. All right. Um, do you have any suggestions on shipping costs and how to manage them effectively? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We use UPS. So if you were to ship on our UPS account, we would just charge that back to you. Whatever UPS charges us, um, we're going to charge that back to you on our invoice to you. Obviously, we have no control over UPS rates. Now, you are welcome, if you choose, to provide your own shipper account. We do not charge a third-party fee. LTL uh, freight shipping is a bit different. Um, anything over 160 pounds has to go LTL. That's going to exceed the limit that we're able to ship parcel. We would obtain an LTL freight quote for you based on the destination and any services required at the destination. And we would advise you of the freight cost and uh, gain your approval before we went ahead and proceeded with the order. Again, you are welcome to provide your own shipper account if you choose to do so. We do not charge a third party fee. All right. Well, that was the last question. So we'll just give... Maybe just hang on a second, just make sure that there's no uh, additional questions that have come through. This is last call for the Q&A. And we got one. <laughs> uh, will the art department build an ad copy or does the logo ad copy need to be submitted complete? There are certain things that our artwork department can do. They can move things around. They can add text, uh, change the colors, uh, increase the size, decrease the size. Uh, however, we are not equipped to offer graphic design services. So we do need uh, you to provide us an existing artwork file. Uh, if it's a vector file, obviously our artwork department can manipulate that. But for the most part, we do need a file. All right. Last call for questions. I don't see anything coming through. So thank you so much, Diana, for presenting our webinar today. And thank you, everyone who who joined in. Uh, like we said, we will be sending out that recording and the PDF and some links to brochures for you. Uh, you will also be getting an email with a survey for attending today's webinar. It should only take you a couple of minutes and we welcome your feedback to make sure that we are presenting the content that is important to you, as well as um, getting any ideas that you might have for future webinars. Uh, so if you have any questions about the webinar today, you can email Diana at that email up on the screen. That's sales at logomatsllc.com. Um, and, and that is all. So thank you so much for joining us today and have a great day. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for sharing your time with us.